do a quick comparison here. We got two different knuckles here. The clean ones are from a WJ, and the dirty ones are out of a JK. Now there's a lot of similarities here. Like for example, these are JK ball joints. They go right in there. Um, they both have the high steer. It kind of depends on how you look at it because it's on kind of a different plane. See this WJ1 in the ball joint plane kind of tilts down. This one kind of just goes straight up. And then this arm here is also higher than this one. So, um, yeah, some similarities and some differences. They both do the same thing, right? They hold a wheel bearing. The JK's caliper bracket is a little bit bigger. And all in all, they're they're really similar. I mean, you can kind of take a look at these and you can see, wow, that's pretty close. The JK one's a little bit meatier, you know, which you'd kind of expect. But there is a subtle difference here. You can swap these back and forth. You can put this WJ knuckle on here and put the uh, JK one on the Data 30 for the ZJ or WJ or whatever. But there's a subtle difference here. And this is what it is. The ball joint upper mount is different so if you put the if you put the opposite on the other axle it'll make it way uh cambered in or cambered out basically so if you take that wj1 with the shorter top it'll suck it way in or if you put the jk1 on the dana 30 from the zj or wj or xj or whatever it'll camber it way out so it is possible to run them but it's you know there's no real reason to do that because of that one subtle difference so yeah uh, pretty cool this one um this ball joint fits a little bit tighter here than it does on this one i don't think it's going to be a problem because once you tighten it down it gets it gets in there but that's the thing is that you have to use the uh the ball joints from the wj in the dana 30 for the zj xj whatever to make it work so the cross reference comes out to be I don't remember what it is. I think it's a 3185 in the bottom and a I don't remember. Those are JK ball joints. You know, they it's the same same basic thing. So these are gonna get pressed into the ZJ and it's gonna get ran like this, but figured this would be a good opportunity to kind of compare and contrast a little bit here. The uh, unit bearings bolt in. Uh, everything else is basically the same, it's just those subtle little differences there.